In this next topic, we knew that Tesla was going to halt production of the Tesla Model Y, but now we have photo evidence of that. So let's take a look at it. But if you're just joining in, Tesla is now halting production of the Model Y from the Giga Texas. There's a pause of it. So let's take a look at it and how this potentially could affect and why it might have already affected some inventory prices for the Tesla Model Y. So let's take a look at it. But if you're just joining in, my name is Dennis. I love talking about Tesla hacking. So definitely hit that subscribe if you're interested. Shout out to Tesla Roddy. They posted this. Tesla Giga Texas production pause may continue through end of through September. So they did, we already knew about this. Tesla and Elon signaled on the last earnings call that production will pause because of upgrades, right? This is Cybertruck upgrades and maybe even Highland upgrades. But this, of course, is Giga Texas per pausing their production. Here is a, another picture from James Cat showing empty lots at Giga Texas of from which usually where the Model 3s were parked. You can see there's plenty of inventory in the back on the left and top, but it seems like the Model Y staging or Model Y staging area is uh, been down for about two weeks. Quote, rumor is production will only resume at the end of the month. 3.5 weeks of lost production in Texas is about 10,000 to 12,000 Model Ys. Here's another picture from Joe. Shout out to Joe on X for posting this. We see some other different things going on on the Tesla Y lot. And that could be why we were taking a look at inventory charts pretty recently. And uh, maybe that's why Model Y inventory did spike pretty low, especially for the Model Y. But of course, you got to remember, there's also the Fremont factory producing the Model Ys as well. But now inventory is also starting to decrease. So if you're in the market for a Model Y, definitely stay on the lookout because inventory on to Waiting for Tesla.com has been a little screwy just like this where there's no Model Ys in inventory. But if you go to Tesla's website, you can still see all the inventory discounts. And that's probably why some of you might be seeing that inventory discounts haven't been aggressive. I think the best they were at was like five to $6,000 off. But maybe in some markets, they've backed down because Tesla vehicles have been selling. But the good thing is there still is the referral program, just like the one down below in the description where you can save an extra $500 off your Model Y or Model 3, Model X, Model X, or even Model S. So definitely check it out. Tesla referral code down below in the description. But it is, it's kind of interesting that Tesla has thought this out pretty well. I mean, they knew they had to hit a end of quarter number. Maybe they had too much inventory. They knew they had a lot of inventory posted on the websites. So they kind of timed this well and they planned it out, which makes sense, right? I mean, there's a lot of smart people hopefully working at the executive board and or sales departments. So it does make sense that why we're not, might be not seeing as many inventory discounts, but that's not to say what happens when the production starts to ramp up again, what's going to be happening through next year or even the later this year through quarter four, maybe even December, because December is always traditionally or end of the quarter is always going to be a crazy time to purchase a vehicle so there could be bigger discounts or even more discounts so don't don't fret if you can't find a vehicle now there's always well unless you need a vehicle now that if you can't find a vehicle now there's always going to be december or even maybe these next few months because tesla insurance insurance rates keep going higher and higher so as tesla insurance sorry tesla interest rates keep going higher and higher and as if they keep going higher then that's when prices just have to come down because there needs to be more purchases. But definitely some pretty interesting stuff. Let me know what your thoughts on it. We're going to jump into the next topic after this water break. <laughs> 